Hello, it's Jess Kevin here. Welcome to day two of Under Stars Nightclub Christmas Special. And today I'm going to be talking about my first thing um, of Under the Stars. So in the last one I didn't talk about anything because I wanted to leave it for this video. So yeah, today we're going to be talking about the first repair sort of thing for Under the Stars Nightclub. So I know it's only two days away, uh, but I kind of I just wanted to... Yeah, I just kind of wanted to talk about it. So I'm going to be making this day series until Friday. So Friday will be the last, uh, well, it'll be the last episode, obviously, uh, of it. Um, and uh, yeah, and then that's it. And then, and then the series will be over, basically, after that. So it's only going to be a five-day one. So uh, yeah, tomorrow be, I'll be talking about something as well, aimed on it. Uh, so today I'm just going to be talking about the, it's kind of a quite simple, but I'm excited for it, really. Uh, I'm just kind of looking forward to going um, and what I'm doing. So yeah, in the last video, I was explaining about what I'm going to be, uh, what I'm going to be doing. So basically, I'm going in a Christmas t-shirt. I'm going in a Christmas uh, Santa t-shirt. Uh, basically, um, yeah, it's got like a, I think it's got Santa on it. And it's got like a turkey on it. Basically, uh, that's kind of a, the aim of the t-shirt. And yeah, I'll be going in that. And then obviously, as I said before, I'm going to be spending uh, spending my time with my friends and jumping up and down and stuff like that. Um, as yep, should be should be quite fun, and uh, yeah, only two days to go until until we get to there. I'm kind of looking forward to it because I know that, as I said from before, like I know that I've been to a lot of under the stars now. Um, but only the problem is like I want I I want to keep going to it basically because it is it, it is pretty cool and I absolutely love it. And I know that there's a lot of people that have started going, so uh, I want to keep going, and I'm kind of really looking forward to it myself, just because it's a very good interesting party. Um, and um, obviously parties and nightclubs and stuff like that, it's just pretty, pretty cool as well. And the thing that I um, that I love about Under the Stars is obviously it's at the Lindmill, if you don't know, uh, because it has three different places and obviously you get the, uh, you get one place, then you get another place, and then you get another one. So there's like three different areas uh, in the uh, in the Lindmill and it's absolutely brilliant as well because it's just amazing as well. So yeah, it's kind of a just very, very good and um, yeah, it should be very, very good. I'm not sure what people are going to be I'm going to be wearing uh, on the night. Uh, I know that obviously, as, as I said, I'm wearing my Christmas T-shirt. But yeah, I'm actually not sure what what what, pe what other people, what the other people will be wearing. I'm not totally sure what they'll be wearing. Hopefully, they're, they're going to be wearing something quite interesting. Or maybe uh, a lot of people might not be wearing anything. They might just be going in normal clothes or something. Because it, it is a Christmas special, so I'm not totally sure what people are going to be wearing. Uh, I don't actually really, really know, but what kind of a sleep. Yeah, what, what what people are, are going to be wearing and, and stuff like that. So, uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to it anyway. Uh, as I said, I'm, I'm, I'm hopefully it's going to be interesting. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully hopefully it should be it should be very very good uh, because it's one of the problems about one of the stars as well is I know that it has a big gap until the next one. Uh, but one of the problem is like it, it I, I don't like how it, how it has a massive gap on it because basically like you can kind of compare to like other things like that, but it just has a massive gap on it and. I know that the problem is, is, I know that I do like Under the Stars, but I know the problem is, like, you can't have it every two or three weeks. And I, 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 and I know it's really annoying, but, like, that's kind of the way how they've done it, basically. And I know that, obviously, there's, like, other places that they have at the lead mill as well. So there's not just that, they have other things as well. But, like, obviously, all that kind of stuff is, like, for tickets and stuff. And, like, I'm not really bothered about all that kind of thing. So, yeah. Another thing I just go there is just for Under the Stars, I guess. And, obviously, there's a lot of my friends that go there that I hang, uh, hang, around with, uh, hang around with and stuff like that and I know that all of them are are pretty cool because obviously all of them kind of like jump up and stuff and yeah all of them are just pretty nice I guess so but um yeah that's what I kind of really love about Under the Stars because it's basically a big massive place where people can just do whatever they want and it's just absolutely brilliant and it's always been the time of my the time of my life basically there and obviously it's pretty pretty cool, uh, like obviously dancing to the music and dancing up and down with, with your friends and stuff, and it, it's, it's just brilliant, as I said, and uh, I I love it. So yeah, it's just it's just absolutely brilliant. So yeah, can't wait for Thursday. Uh, hopefully it's going to be good, and uh, yeah, hopefully I get myself prepared because what I'm going to be doing on the Thursday anyway is obviously I know that I do have college, but I'll be going. Uh, well, I'll I'll well if you don't know on a Thursday, I I, I usually go in town for a bit. On a Thursday, uh, that might that might end up happening. I'm not totally sure, and then I'll be going out basically because I've got to get home at least uh, 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 
least uh, at about five o'clock uh, because uh, I usually set off at about six because it takes me about an hour from there. Um, well, well, I think it's usually about an hour anyway, or about half an hour. Uh, obviously, the trams do take a bit of a while to come, so I'll be waiting about like half an hour or something like that. And uh, yeah, I usually get down there for about quarter to seven, and I usually see people queuing up and going in there. So, yes, yeah, so that's what I'll be doing on that night, basically, just to wait for the people to come. And then, obviously, I'll be waiting in the queue until we end up getting in there uh, for the uh, for the big night. So, yeah. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much everything that I've said, really. I can't really think of anything else to say, apart from that I'm, that I'm just excited, really, about it. And I know that I've always been for quite a long time. So, um, yeah, can't wait for it. And hopefully, it should, it should be pretty good. Uh, and also with everyone there as well, that could be really cool as well. Yeah, getting excited for it. Hopefully, it should be, should be interesting. As well, should be, should be really, really cool. So I'm kind of looking, looking forward to. Uh, yeah, looking, looking forward to it. But should be, should be really, really cool. So, yep. So hopefully, you guys, I've enjoyed this video. Um, and uh, I've kind of run out of things to say, but I think I've kind of mentioned everything. So, um, yeah. Hopefully, you guys. Um, yeah, I've, I've enjoyed, so, um, yeah, uh, so, yeah. So, yeah. See you later. Bye.